Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome to Shen Plays. Welcome back to the land of Tunis, where we are invading France. It's actually a defensive war, but eh, whatever. We're invading France anyway, because France is douchebags. And we have plans for further invasions, including revolutionary Spain and Kara Koinlu to get our achievement. Well, it's actually not an achievement, but I would love that I would love to make United United Islam an achievement. This has been a decision in the game for years and years and years. All right, I'm sorry. For a long time, probably since like 1.1 or 1.2. But it's not an achievement. It really should be an achievement. Anyway, let's um let's go. And yeah, it says, all of my own provinces have to be in the Muslim religion group. So we have a lot of conversions to do. Like, a lot of conversions to do. Oh my god. I guess we could just release a custom vassal. We could release uh, a vassal as all of these provinces that are not going to be Muslim. That's fine. Like, right before the end of the game. We have one... what was that? We won the Siege of Anjou. Oh, you know what I noticed that's different about uh, EU4 and Vicky 2? In Vicky 2, when you see we have won the Siege of whatever, or we won the battle or whatever, you can click on that in the text box down here. You can click on that, and it'll take you to that province. That's why I, I've been asking for that to be in EU4, because it's like, you can do it in Vicky 2. I'm pretty sure Vicky 2 came out a while ago. Why can't you do the new 4 You know? You know? You feel me? Anyway. Oh wow, Serbia has a navy out here. Oh, Serbia, you're gonna lose your navy. He has two, two units on a transport and he's gonna lose them. Poor Serbia. We're under attack. What's up, France? Did you want to say hi? Well, hello. And how are you today, France? Do you enjoy attacking us? Because it doesn't look like you enjoyed that. Yep, we win, you lose. Suck it, France. Suck it, France. We win, you lose. That felt so good, sinking France's fleet in the last episode. If you guys didn't see the last episode, we sunk France's fleet with a stack of 500 ships. He was uh, just dicking around in the Mediterranean, sailing around, doing who knows what. And we undocked 500 ships on his face. And he's like, uh, splat. Man, these missions suck. Alright, so the plan was to declare on Afghanistan. Um, and to take Baghdad and then spit out Oman. And during that war, declare on revolutionary Spain. That way we don't have to worry about the coalition. Yeah, I think it's a good plan. It's a solid plan. And Austria won't join against us because... Why would they? They hate revolutionary Spain. They hate us too, but not quite as much as revolutionary Spain. There's just something about revolutionary Spain. Doctors hate him. This one little revolution. France is sieging my South American lands. Okay. Oh, right. I need to hand these over. Sons of Colombia. Oh, yeah. I should definitely give these to him in the peace deal. But, looks like we're not going to be giving any land to the Sheikhs of America. They're the ones who were in the war initially. It was a defensive war for them, but we can't give them any lands. But we can try. I mean, is there going to be anything available... I don't think so. By the time it's ready, by by the time we're ready to end the war, there's not going to be any land siege down here. It's too bad, but we'll do our best. All right. So when we're done with this siege, why don't we start moving this guy over? Let's meet up in Constantinople. Let's meet up in Adir. We'll move over. We'll merge and split. So we'll have two armies to run towards Karakoinu. How many troops do you have, Karakoinu? Forty K. Alright. Oh good, my loud upstairs neighbor plumbing just started. I hope you enjoy it while they serenade us. 
they are expert plumbing um, musicians. Sure, plumb musicians. Ooh, Ile de France is about to fall. Nice. Ile de Pérez. Yes, Ile de Pérez. All right, let's put some troops on the Spanish border. I guess we can go speed three here. There's not a whole lot going on. Yeah, speed three is fine. All right, finish the siege, please. Come on, 77%. Finish the damn siege. I got shit to do with you, bro. Come on. This is silly here. Come on. There you go. Okay, go to a deer. Yeah. What are my force limits? Uh, a lot. Force limit of 536. We currently have 505. How does revolution work? I really don't know. This is my first time I've ever seen it. I've seen posts on uh, Reddit about revolutionary, 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 revolutionary Lithuania. I thought that was interesting. Really? A one stack just unseized Anjou? Are you fucking kidding? Yeah. That happened. Are you shitting me? One guy just unseized Anjou. That's bullshit. I have to go up there and hit the goddamn siege button. And he just got an end of the month bonus. So it's gonna be like, what, 600 defenders now? 400, still. Oh my fucking god, you gotta be kidding me. A one stack. We got our claim on Spain. Let's go ahead and claim uh, Cantabria. Can you get there more quickly, please? Like before the end of the month. There you go. So we'll just hit the button. Hopefully we'll get it. 400 defenders. Go for it. Nice. Okay, it wasn't that bad. But we had to spend some military points to get it. Oh, right, I forgot to tech up. Do I want to tech up? 583, sure. Ooh, enlightened despotism. Do we want that? Wow, 10% cheaper accepted culture. I think I'll hold off. I do want to do that. It's very, it sounds cool, but I think it makes more sense to save up admin points for coring things. All right, you guys can group and split. Okay, put some guys here and here. Okay. You guys are enjoying the plumbing sounds? Yeah. Sorry about that. It's the joys of living the apartment life. Now, we could take another idea group. I was thinking of taking another military idea group. Uh, probably defensive. But I really don't know if we need it. What would even be useful here? We're so close to the end of the game, I don't even know if there's anything useful. 
I think we'll just leave it alone for now. Plague. Goodbye, money. I hardly knew ye. But yeah, let's get our troops ready for the war with Spain. And the war with uh, Kara Koinlu. Yeah, defensive has a good morale bonus, and you don't you don't have to finish defensive. You only need the first two ideas to get uh, the 15% morale bonus. It's really strong. It's not as good as France's Elan, which is a free it's a free 20% morale bonus that he gets. Yeah, for free. It's not as good as that, but uh, it's pretty good. All right, I think we're okay to, to declare on Afghanistan here. Let's do that. Oh, we're going to have to call him as a co-belligerent? Oh, shit. I don't want to make him a co-belligerent. Oh, but I'm going to have to, don't I? I didn't think you could make co-belligerents out of people who are coalitioning you. I think I have to co-belligerent him. That way we can make sure he spits out o Oman. Man, that sucks. You know what? Let me fabricate one more claim before we do this. Yeah, the only claim is Baghdad. Does Oman not have cores on anything? Yeah, he does not have a core on Suhar. Interesting. I think I'm going to fabricate on Abd al Qais. That way we can walk through Oman. Yeah, it's a good plan. Abd al Qais. Right at the top. Excellent. Have I ever been to, the, to Europe? Yes. Um, I've been to. France and Italy, and that's it. Alright, now this means Bamanis is going to be in the war, and no, it should be okay. He has like 80,000 troops, but we'll see how it goes. Alright. There is never enough war, folks. There is never enough war. Hey, Paris has fallen. Oh no, I was discovered fabricating, but I'm already at war with you, so it doesn't matter. You caught me. Alright, Bomanis is in the war. That's that's bad. He's got like 80,000 troops. Alright, call for peace on France. Yeah, we're pretty much ready to peace out France. I hate call for peace. So annoying. So our war over here is pretty much against everything you see. It's a big war. I hope we can handle it. It's almost time for war with Spain. Uh, let's get, let's see, I need one more fabrication, right? Yeah, let's fabricate on Valencia, and then we'll, we'll start the fabrication of Valencia. Then we'll declare war, and then we'll peace out France. Oh shit, 46,000 French peasants just spawned on my face. Shit.
Ow. Oh, right, I have an army over here, of course. Hello there. Goodbye there. <laughs> oh, God damn. Oh, there's the rest of his army, I see. Oh, he's a 4-5, wow. Let me steal generals. I want one down here. And one over here. Oh, you're busy. Um, here, take out one dude. No, 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 one dude. I'll give you a general. Okay. Oh, yeah, Siege Zero, but still. We can use him to fight. Let's go fight this idiot. I wonder if I can just peace bomb on us out. Uh, no, his enthusiasm is high. Damn it. Alright, fair enough. We're at six out of three generals. Wow. And of course, this little one guy. One little dude has the walls busted. Welcome to bullshit land. That's exactly what happened in Anjou when we lost Anjou. One guy with no general or anything. He just, he just walks in and busts the walls up right away. It's like, you know what? I'm badass. I'm France. Okay, there we go. Okay, killed another stack of troops, very good. Alright, let's start doubling up these armies. They need to be large stacks because Spain's walking around with a stack of 45. His tech is... oh, he's actually one behind us in tech, lovely. Oh good, the upstairs neighbor's plumbing is off. I can think again! And we could tech up, but we are... Well, you know what? This might be worth it, because we get a, a morale bonus, and we get new units and new tactics. Yeah, let's do it early. We're going to tech up early. We're going to waste a bunch of points, get new units. And now we're two techs ahead of Spain. Oh, it's beautiful. Claim Kutch. Am I at war with Kutch? Oh no, that's France. I can't... Why you give me missions that I can't do? I Well, you know what? I'll take it. And then we can uh, fabricate as soon as we're done with the war with France. Right? Right. We can start the fabrication when we're, when we're piecing out France. Okay. Uh, no, no, no. Don't declare war yet. I need to fabricate on Viseus. Viscaya, whatever. 
All right, France, I've had enough of you. It's time for peace. Okay, those are our claims, so we'll take our claims. Um, is there anything else we want to do? Oh, right, 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 South America, right, 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 right. Sons of Colombia, 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 Sons of Colombia. Okay, that's good. And then up here, is there anything left? All got unseaged. Germany's up here sieging stuff. Sure, give some of this shit to Germany. Oh, I can't. Why not? Oh, because it's all expensive as fuck. I don't have enough Diplo points. Wait, what? Oh, to take these down here would be 25 each. Oh my goodness. Well, I'm sorry. I'm not going to spend 25 each on that shit. Fuck it. What about if we make him release somebody? Is that going to work? Turn cores to Bomanis, Austria, Hansa. No. I can make him release Ulm. That wouldn't even be France, though. Make him release Normandy. That's probably the best option. Or Gujarat. Gujarat's a pretty good one. No, I think it was do Normandy. That, that, that works. And take war operations, of course. Holy shit. He has 3,000 ducats to give me. Alright. I love it. Three thousand ducats. Oh shit, I forgot to declare war on Spain. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Um, okay, that's bad. Uh, okay, so we have nine days before our diplomat arrives. Then we can declare war on Spain. In those nine days, I'm really hoping nobody coalitions us. Please, no coalition. Please, no coalition. Nine days. Don't coalition. Don't coalition. Okay, France has unrivaled us. That's fine. Don't coalition. 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 Oh, thank God. No coalition. Oh, but I lost my claim on Dauphine. That's stupid. Oh, we have to wait until the 12th of February anyway. Uh, yeah, I don't... Why do you lose your claims right after the war is over? That's bullshit. They should give you, like, six months or whatever to click the core button. But they don't. Paradox, this is, this is absolute garbage. You shouldn't be forced to click the button, you know, the instant you peace out. Or you lose your claim. I already lost my claim on a province. That's, that's, that's really, really dumb. Anyway. Uh, do I want to core this stuff? I think I plan on creating... Uh, oh, no, it's right, I can't. I was going to say I plan on creating a... Um, what is it called? I don't even know what they're called. Client states. I plan on creating a client state, but you can't do it in a continent where you, where you don't have your capital. And since Tunis cannot move his capital out of Europe... I can't move my capital to Europe. Or right, since, since Tunis cannot move his capital out of Carthage, I cannot move my capital to Europe, therefore I cannot create a client state in Europe. So what I could do is create a vassal up here and just sell him a whole bunch of shit. I really don't want to do that, but I don't see what choice we have. We'll probably do that like right before the end of the game. Alright, so 
Right, we have to wait until the 12th to declare. Please, no coalition. Austria still won't join against us because he hates Spain. So we're going to go with the CB Crush the Revolution. Yes. What's up, Spain? So does Spain have a good navy? Oh yeah, he's got a real good navy. Holy shit. So we may want to rein in our trade fleet for a little while here. Maybe we'll just merge our trade fleets for the time being. He's coming for my face. What you got, Spain? What you got? He has no general, of course. Because Spain is so badass, he does not need a general. <clears throat> yeah, we've never really done these revolutionary wars before, so we'll see how they go. Crush the revolution. It sounds fun. Uh, let's take this stack down here, and let's go fight Kar Quinlu's army with this. He's running into the desert. All right, well, whatever. Alright, looks like he's attacking us in Soria. I can swap in a 2-5. No, I'll take the 6-3. Nope, he changed his mind. No more attack. Okay, fair enough. Oh, he has a second army here. Lovely. Let's kill it. Oh, he's actually sending his entire army to Madrid. Do I want to just fight him there? Not really. I'd rather be defending. Hey, Baghdad has fallen. Great. You can go here, and then there. Is he going to attack me or what, Spain? I don't think so. I think he's going to try to avoid me. Why is my navy outside of the Mediterranean? This is a bad place for you to be. Well, we do have an admiral there. No, we're fine. Yeah, we're fine. Alright, let's get the attack on. He has no general here. This is perfect. Don't know where his generals are, but as long as they're not here, works for me.
And is this going to be another war where Bamanis doesn't show up? This is the second time we've been at war with Bamanis, and he didn't show up last time. He never brought any troops up. And it looks like he's doing the same thing. I don't know. <clears throat> Alright, let's party. Party in Madrid! Rolling zeros does not help. All right, I got the QQ capital. Let's go siege him up. Go for base tax. Don't worry too much about one base tax province. All right, we did not crush him, but I will follow him and crush him. I want this guy dead. What's up, Spain? Oh, yeah. God, that felt good. Alright, let's kill this army. We are on a fucking roll. We're not supposed to embargo France anymore because he's not my rival. Okay. Fine. What's up, Spain? Oh my god, we just crushed a 44 stack. We just crushed a 44 stack. That's so good. Well, that's going to be a quick war. Time to carpet siege. Oh, Spain. We're two techs ahead of him, and he doesn't have any generals for some reason. Yep, hello Groomer 2K. Oh, Spain. Take over the siege, and I'm going to go attack this guy. God, he has a 4-5. Oof. Pretty brutal. Oh, wow. Province already fell. That was quick. Zat was quick. All right, hurry up. Get over there. Get over there. Come on. Oh, my God. This guy. Oh, my God. Spain's provinces are falling so quickly. Are these level 1 forts? No, they're level 2s. Alright, kick some QQ butt. Yeah, rebels in Florence. Oh, God. 23 rebels in Florence. All right, I got to put an army there. And 
I should give them a general, so let's steal one. You'll do just fine. Yoink. Mine. Okay. Grab him. Okay. QQ, you fight like a woman. Oh my god, these provinces are falling so quickly. I don't understand. Go to Florence. Oh, they didn't die. Okay, fair enough. I wonder where he's going. Probably somewhere here in the desert. Let's go to Musket. Let's just assume it's Musket. It's gotta be Musket. Is it musket? Yeah, it's musket. Okay, good. At least we know where he's headed. Um, yeah, I need someone in Castilla Vieja. Uh, you can do that. Wow, Spain, you're a pushover. What happened? Get out of here, Rebels. No one likes you. You know what, though? That's going to be it for this episode today. Thank you guys for joining me. I have been Shen. You have been you. Come back next time where we will go ahead and finish our mission mission to fabricate on France. Uh, we're going to see if Bamanis joins the war at all. I mean, he's in the war, but he hasn't sent any units up. And if he never does, then, yeah, that's fine, too. Uh, in this war, we plan on taking Baghdad and spitting out Oman. And from Castile, I want to take the coastline up here, and I want to uh, break the revolution. Because fuck him. Anyway, that's going to be next time. I'll see you then. Have a good day.